Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome back to RimWorld, what I expect to be an, uh, an explosive episode. <laughs> Actually, it's been a while since I recorded. I've been busy. Had a real busy end of last week, then took off for a three-day trip somewhere, and just got back, and almost didn't have time to record tonight. My next two nights are busy, so I'm going to be a little bit uh, few and far between for a while, but yeah, we're dealing with these guys. Hmm, we've got there. I wonder where that fifth one was. He's hiding in there. Whoa, he's an old one. Scyther, age 1689. Whoa, 1400 years old, 1100 years old, only 500 years old. This one's a youngin. And 600 years old. These guys, almost 2000 years old. Man, when were these things built? Huh, I never really noticed that extreme of age on these before but they're on their way in and you know they want to hurt us <clears throat> badly so i've decided it's time to pull out the big guns we've got eric over here just dropped his shield belt so he can use this thing and trying to, this orbital uh power beam targeter trying to figure out where best to put them i thought about there that was the original plan that's not an eric why didn't that work that's where I want you. Okay. Um, but it's line of sight. What I've figured out about this thing is that it is... Let's see here. If I click him, there we go. I've got to fire within this range. And it will cause an explosion that big. That's basically how this guy works. I can't use it outside of the walls. It's, it's line of sight. So... I've got to go where, you know, I can't shoot it over here. He's got to be able to see it, just like a, like a rifle. So he's got to be within basically the same range that they can be shooting him at in order to fire this thing. So putting him here doesn't allow me to shoot anything coming through here. Put him right here it does, but that range there is about here to about here, which means all this goes on fire. Here... If we were to hit over here, then maybe it would do some good, but they'll be coming through and going along and right like that. So that's no good. Uh, if I put them here, and if they happen to come around like this, then I could take out this whole area right here and rebuild that corner. That's a possibility. Um, there to there is like here to probably right there. I have to hit him right at the edge so that it finally makes contact about here, which gives us basically that round sphere. Yeah, no matter what I do, I'm lighting this place on fire. It's a big, it's a big blaze. It's a big zone that it's going to destroy, and it's just, it's going to go boom. So it'd be great to use it out here somewhere. But by the time I get him out there to take them out over here, there's no getting him back. It's got to work, or he's dead. So, that's a bit risky. We could put him right here. Could put him right here. He can reach out and hit this area. Or he can hopefully hit... Well, he'd have to be down here. There's no way they're going to go down underneath and, and accommodate him. They're going to hug the walls and come in. So, what to do with that thing? It's not the best map to use it on. I guess that's what I'm trying to get to. I could put him in here and he could hide in there. And then when they come to get them, blow them up right here and then run them back through as all the rest of them come after them. I don't know. That's a great plan either. Poor Eric. He's not that expendable. we got to kind of keep him alive through this. Um, other options. If I run him to this door here and stick him out there and have him jump around and get their attention, they may come down and I could light, you know, this area. Hmm... From here, I've got this area. Okay, from right there, we have a line of sight. That would work. Though they would... What would they do? I would imagine some are... We were doored everywhere in between. So some of them... I'm thinking this one and this one. Why is it giving me a, a red circle there? interesting what does that mean let's do that again it doesn't mean that I can actually go out and shoot them right there can I if that's the case I'll take this whole group out right now before it wouldn't let me do that 
I was under the impression that we were, unless it's, unless I'm thinking of the opposite, you know, the mortars cannot shoot within this range. But it tells you that somewhere. Doesn't it? It does not. Okay. So is that, you know, mortars have to be shot beyond that point. Am I completely wrong here? And we're, what we're talking about is the same thing. It's got to be beyond this point. But no, because it gives me the range inside of it. It, I can't do it here. Or anywhere out in here. But I can target an individual. Does that mean when that individual gets within range of that big circle? Okay, we have too many mysteries here. We're going to have to get this thing solved. If we were just telling them to do that, we'll have to wait, watch and see what happens. Otherwise, we're going to get Eric moving to somewhere. I think that somewhere just might be right there. And just see what he's capable of doing. It really depends on how many of them went this way. And if he got there in time, I have a feeling they're going to be here long before he can get all the way up to there. I'm Yeah, I'm pretty sure about that. I think our only chance is over here. I think he's, we're going to have to just destroy the corner here in order to, to see this thing shoot. But let's see what that does. I, I'll be curious. Otherwise, Tomislav, most of them are going to grab a meal. <clears throat> it's, it's the end of the day and they're all hungry. Grab a meal and they're going to meet over here. And we'll just figure out what to do with them. So let me buzz through here real quick. All the lines going that way are pretty much all of them getting a meal and doing that. Who's that? Shantiko. He is... Cute. He didn't need a meal, so he's already heading up to Sniper from here. I think that might be an error. I think so. Shantiko, I think your best bet is to get over to here. So the other one was Gnarly, if I remember right. Let's get you instead to here. Yeah. Otherwise, Shantigo, Klaus. So zoom out a little bit. And they're all heading for kind of this zone right here. Right there. There. So even the melees. Oh, yeah, the melees. I found something to do with. Eric, of course, is going to go blow the world up. And David, I'm going to have you go and equip some EMP grenades. And we'll see if we can't, uh, you know do uh, scary things with you with those those spook me the cooldown is so long by the time you throw it there's no time to get out of there so i'm not sure how i want to deal with that bill is going to grab a meal right yeah and then you're going back to work as backup on these guys okay and then c stars is going to go grab some emp grenades and kaya is heading out to the the rallying point and Faith doesn't fight, so I'm not real sure what to do with her right now, but she's grabbing a meal to get her out of the garden. We'll figure that out afterwards. Manuela is operating a turret, and Radar is going to go to the meeting place. Cyprian is operating a turret, until, but he was hungry, so until the other two go and grab meals, and then they'll, replace, they'll take their place. And I missed you, so Cyprian, there you are. Bliss, you're heading for the meeting meetup place. Billy, what you doing? You are going to be back up for the turrets, also the uh, the mortars. Okay, George, you are actually running a mortar right now. Okay, and we've got Diamond going to meet up there after a meal. Daniel, same thing. Oath Knight, same thing. And Gnarly's heading out there to snipe right now. So Gnarly and Shantika were the only ones who didn't need a meal. They, they, they grabbed a big old afternoon snack. You know, they uh, grabbed a hoagie and just uh, pigged out when nobody was looking. Um, so really, it's these guys and the first of the mortars coming in. Nobody has gotten there yet. Nobody is... Oh, Cyprian's there, so it'll probably be the first one to launch. Okay. And... Dare we do EMPs? What do we have in EMPs? You're these guys? We have four there and none over here. And I don't know that it's going to do any good. It's just going to pause them. It's not going to harm them. So they'll be paused and then when it runs out, they'll maybe be paused again then it runs out. So it's not going to hurt them and I want to hurt them. I need to I need to to cause some casualties on their way in. So we've got all these. Let me make sure I didn't miss anything. You are aimed at 
right into the pack there, okay? And you are aiming into right there. And you. Where's my red line? Right into there also. Okay. So everyone's assigned. We need to now see what Eric's going to do. So, theoretically, he's attacking Centipede. What does that mean? He's standing. I think he's actually going to launch that thing. Okay. Uh. <laughs> um. Is he is he using the force? Um. I don't think anything's happening. It was a three second countdown. We've we've gone past that, so I don't think that works. He needs to be in line of sight. I'm pretty sure he needs to be within that circle. So Eric, why don't you um um <laughs> come on over here? Um, right there. You go there. Thank you. Isabel, you get inside. Piggy, you get inside. Piggy 77. And where did our Piggy go that was squealing all the way home through here after being attacked? Well, here comes four of them. Ooh, four out of five went that way. Five out of five? I'm clicking and looking. There's nobody over here. They all went this way? Oh, come on. Where's five? There's five. One, two, three, four, and five. They're all going this way. Ooh. We just might have a chance. Eric, if you can get there in time. Okay. They can't go through here. They have to go through here. Which means I need Eric right there. Shantigo, you instead are going here. Eric, you are going there. And then Shantigo, well, we'll leave you there. Okay. Okay. Here, these three are going to start us off. Isabel is in. Gnarly is rushing through and around. Where are you guys at? Where are they at? Where'd they go? They were just... Oh, we got a lot of debris over here. They're taking their time. One, two, three, four. Yep. Okay. Oh. Boom. There was a boom. The ground just shook. I missed the boom. What did we not hit? I don't see any red. Would I get a sense of injuries? Okay, we didn't actually hit anything. Oh, or did the ground, did it hit or was that the launch? Let's see if there's any lines coming out of here. No lines, okay. So we didn't make contact and we're using the high explosive shells. So it's a small pattern. We're not gonna, you know, we've got to actually make direct hit but we did a pretty good job of that last time so we're still aiming at which one aiming at this loner that's probably not good let's set you into there let's get the best chance we've got and that's which one that's that one so you are aiming up in this way you're your lone one going that way let's aim you guys into here as well let's go for the pack chance of hitting an individual are pretty small there you also, yep, yeah, I wanted that one. Let's send you into this one. All right. Oh, what was that noise? I think they were talking. Oh, it was that. Okay. All right. So when who's going to launch next? You have got seven seconds left. You have got 20 seconds left, and you have got 8.8 seconds left. That one's going to launch next. Otherwise, we have what going on? Klaus is in position. Klaus has a sniper. Klaus, you head to here. Can you do it smart? You cannot. Klaus, you're going to go here, then here, then here. Thank you. You're in place. You guys are still up in here. Okay, good. And I need to pay attention to what's happening around here this time rather than get back here later and realize there's 14 people sitting here going, um, aha. Uh -huh. When's he going to remember? Shield belt, unforbid. Get a pick, put that away. Michael is here next. Assault rifle. Do we have any more unclaimed snipers? I think we're going to use assault rifles for this one. Which means I need you here, Michael. I'm going to shoot down this length as soon as I turn the corner. I don't think I want to get him any closer or any further. Assault rifle should go, I think, from here to here. There's halfway. The closer, the more accurate. 
but the closer the more accurate they are too so yeah they, they shoot quick okay that's you and that is you anybody else working their way through besides dogs a lot of dog names in here Manuela's over here Faith's over there Faith is on her way in Bill's on his way in and no more people's over there and Daniel's on his way out and Kaya is on her way out okay that it there's a handy Handy is it seems like there were a couple that were on their way to get sniper rifles I just don't remember which ones they were yeah, nothing's written in here Hmm, there were two good sniper rifles, and I thought I assigned two people to those sniper rifles. <sighs> I don't know. We'll just let them get a little closer and find out. Okay, so the next thing that happens then is this shot. Ah, uh, here, right? Kapoom. Boom. There you are. Follow you in. And. And. Nothing. Almost took out a pig. Did we? Did we hit a pig last time? No, no injuries. <laughs> okay, where are we at? We're still... There's one. Ah, got to here. There. There's our first one. Okay, Eric's in place. Gnarly and Shantika are in place. Um, what happened to Klaus? No, there's Handy. Klaus is right there. He's getting into place. Handy, what to do with you? You can back up Michael. How so? You're going to go there. You two can shoot from that area. Okay, and then we have a Kaya coming in with an assault rifle. Um, how best? Let's... Boy, there's no, there's no cover. This doesn't count as cover from that rock. There's just nothing there. Um, there. And Daniel. Hmm. Just got thinking. I can put Michael and now you'll be shooting through Klaus. Okay, I put the two of them that were in here right there first, and then move them down. But Klaus's head will be in the way. Um. Boy. Word. This is such a. I've oh, got another shot going off. Such. A, they're going to come in and fire quickly. There's not going to be a lot of time of getting them out. And when there's no cover, there's just a really good chance they're not going to ever get out. It's a spooky one. Almost one I'd rather have the traps do most of their work first. I kind of rather would. Handy's assigned. Let's have Kaya and Daniel work on the next phase. You two are going to be in there. Two shots through take all the traps two shots from here maybe a third and a fourth as they start to roll in okay I'm more comfortable with that let's see where this is going and then you are coming around I've gotta gotta be aware of this I need that to launch as soon as boy as soon as the three come in not the two not, not the single let's back up a little bit so we can watch that and you guys as soon as you turn the corner I gotta make a decision that one might hit. It just might. And you're getting so close to that corner. Okay, I gotta stop there. You, range, you're not there yet. But see, I can't shoot out here. I got a, a crossed circle there. No target. Which means that just didn't make any sense. Didn't make any sense. But over here, it makes sense. I can hit right there and light this whole place on fire. As soon as you cross that line. Which means these other ones will run into it. We just hit? We hit. We did some damage. And we killed a pig. Well, we wounded a pig. But we did some damage. You, centipede. We've got second body ring, third body ring, fourth body ring, fifth body ring. And Mr. Pig is has no immediate danger, but is, has a bleeding rate of 500%. I kind of think it's a problem with the calculating of that one. Um, I'm thinking Eric is going to attack the first one and see if the others run into it. I think that might be smart because this first one's going to take these guys out. So, we're there. Can you fire at Scyther? 
you can. All right, here's what we've been waiting almost 200 episodes to see. What is this gonna do? Tink, 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 tink. Whoa! We're under fire. Are you guys taking damage? Why are they not taking damage? Well, you are. You are, and you aren't. Hmm. Eric, hop inside. And you guys fire. Klaus, you should be in range. You're ready to fire. Daniel has an assault. Kaya has an assault. Let's get them out anyway. Kaya, you're going there. And Daniel, you're going there. Let's just try it. But boom. That's, yeah. That was it. That is our death ray of, of energy coming down from these ancient satellites to catch the, the very safe dish that catches all that and turns it into power, but we're kind of missing the dish. And we've got to shut down our our ability to uh, uh, to put out fires for a while, unfortunately. There, actually the whole realm here has to, has to go away. That's quite the effect. Wow. But why are we randomly not hitting things? Okay, are you still... You just got a gunshot. Okay, and you are already aiming. You got to a tree. Okay, so I gotta get you guys in. Who are you aiming at, by the way? You are taking out Gnarly. Gnarly, you... Got a circle on you? You're just about ready to get out of there. So you back off. Shantigo, you... Back off? You might be able to do something from there. What can you do? <clears throat> you... 23% chance. 28% chance. From here, it might be better. Um, I gotta hold off on you two. So you go back to the original plan. There and there. You're out of there. Can you hit Klaus? 7% chance. You stick it out. Alright. You two are downed. You have got no injuries. How can that have no injuries? Maybe it had to be there for the initial impact. I don't know. Um, what else is happening? We got pigs bringing in bodies like crazy. Faith, can I <laughs> disturb you to burn bodies? <laughs> Ah, uh, your mood's not in the greatest shape, that's for sure. Um, well, you're going to get some food, though. Yeah, we could try that. We could have you burn bodies for a while. At least a few of them. You'll see five of them and go crazy and you'll go to bed. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> uh, hit them. Good. Are you taking any damage now? You just... Oh, oh, you turned around. Now you're taking damage. All right. And now you're aiming at Shantigo, who's trying to get out of there. And now you're taking damage. Okay, there's a there's a time delay here. You are attempting to aim at Klaus. 3% chance. You are still attempting to aim at Shantigo. Now a 2% chance. Now a 2% chance. Stay right there. You will eventually. Boom. Okay, Shantigo. Dodge. Good. Now, you're shooting over at Klaus. You're missing two. Okay. Boy, that lasts for a long time. Look at the damage we're doing here. And you got away with it. It didn't take any damage at all. The rest of them are all down. There's two of them in there. There's two of them in there. So we have four of them down right there. So that took care of the worst of them. Well, the fast ones. Put it that way. Um, you stay there. Gnarly hop back out. Kaya out. Let's get one round out of you guys. So Daniel, you might get a shot in there. Actually, you go right there where, where Gnarly was. And we'll see what happens here. So that was the orbital beam targeting whatever that's what it did. Now, there's an orbital beam that comes down. There's also a bombardment one where just bombs start dropping all over. That would have been wild. Okay, we got lots of burning going on here. We're going to lose some garden, but that's about it. I think we don't have to worry too much about that. The big guys are still... All the, five of them are going this way. 
One's right there. Okay. So you're going there. Um, once again, we are targeting whom? Right there. Coming in on these two. All right, that still works. Most of them are going to... I think two out of three are going after that one. So that's fine. Okay, well, that happened. Now what's happening out here? We have a grandma who... Ha! <sighs> Dare I put her right here? Dare I? That is questionable. Hmm. Because Michael is immune for two or three or four in front of him, but that's five in front. One, two, three, four. He's right there. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I don't know. Um, we have both Knight here who wants in on it. Let's put him out there. Actually, right there. Radar. Let's get a packer. Well, I'm just debating where this guy's going to stop. Let's just see what happens here. You're not aiming yet. Shantigo, pop back out. Let's get one shot off on everybody. You have got... Oh, you've already stopped. Just like that. Okay. This didn't work. Kaya, you, you're out. Gnarly, did you shoot? You did. You're out. Uh, go here. The assault rifles can't reach. That's the problem. Shantigo... You're at 12%. I'll let you hang just a little bit. Klaus, you in range? You are. Let's see what happens with this guy. Okay, that was a big boom. Did you shoot yet? I don't think you did. If you did, I missed it. You reset each time. Interesting. Gnarly, why don't you go say hi one more time. Klaus, you got another shot soon? You do. You're going to get a shot off, though. You're going after Shantiga. Oh, that looks like it's right on target. Oh, just missed. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. Now you're going after... I'm thinking it's still Shantigo. Klaus, what you got? Did you really hit the wall? You hit the wall. Um, What's your range look like? Dare I send you... As soon as you shoot next, I'm sending you to there. Now, one more time. You got a ways to go, though you could cross through that. I don't know how you'd fit, but you could have essentially crossed through that. Hmm. Okay. Um. I was looking to see if we had a faith yet, slaving over the hot oven, but nope. And we got a lot of people congregating here, but there aren't any snipers in this, and I need snipers. So now you guys just hang for a minute. You're wave two. All right, so you, as soon as you take this shot, he resets every time. Oh, that's nice. I just, you've got an assault rifle. You do. Hmm. Dare I send Kaya to here with all this cover? I think the distance would work. Kaya, you, you're so close. Daniel. Just out of range. <sighs> yep, he resets every time. Okay, with that shot. Klaus, you go there. No, you go there. Okay, um, what just launched? You did. Let's try to keep an eye on that mortar going in. Otherwise, shots are going in here. Hitting them again. And... We've taken quite a few shots there. Um, neck, shoulder, arm, blade, left, left, shoulder, thorax. No eye, so that's not affecting his, his accuracy yet. But you are at a cool down. Where is that aiming? It's heading for here. I've still got a couple seconds. Let's watch this another shot or two. Hit him again. Okay, you're going to shoot this time. You're still going after Shantigo. You still have only a 8% chance. I think you did take some damage. So, Eric, what do we do with an Eric here? I forgot all about him. We need to let Eric get some food. You go get a meal and go to bed. Good job. So, Michael, you are over here. You're waiting for the, this guy to give up and go around the corner, which probably isn't going to happen. So, Michael, you've got an assault. 
Handy you've got an assault. Here won't reach. Here's too dangerous. I think you're all round two. You're all uh, caterpillars or centipedes, whatever they are. Let's just take this guy out. Here's the shot. Coming in. Oh, that looks like a headshot. It missed. Whew. This one come in yet? I still hear it. It just missed. Oh, okay. Over here. Ah, another one coming in. Let's watch that one, but let's see what he's going to do. Boom, boom, boom. Shot coming in. Boom. Klaus took the kill. Right. Combat. Klaus's sniper rifle bullet was... The thorax was crushed into bits. Okay. They're done. We're a half hour into this, and we need to watch this guy hit and then plan for the next wave. Close. Shield user using ranged weapon. Ah, we got to drop all of the uh, the shields for you guys. Okay, so gear and drop <clears throat> and same thing with sea stars over here. We let's just get that one done. Gear and drop. Then I got to reassign you, right? Yeah. Come up here and grab the second one. Equip. David, you're heading to where? We're probably following a similar path. Let's try put you there. In fact, for now, I can put some fires out. Actually, I can. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Let's do that. Everybody undraft that right there we go oh let's try that again let's redraft uh how do i do that about losing everybody i can't i gotta redo it okay let's give me zones and put this back into home zone and do that okay let's grab everyone through here again besides hmm Where's Sea Stars? She was further away. Everybody else can. Right there. All of you guys, green. There we go. That worked. You guys put out the fires. There's no danger. We did get five of these guys, right? Various. One, two, three. One of these was a stack. 90 and 81. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. So they're all done. Let's put all that out and even haul them in possible sure let's set up a big run over here what time is it 20 hundred we've got two hours to get everybody in here and let's zone and expand the yeah the dog area into wait a minute oh i put them all in the kibble zone how do we deal with that let's do it this way animals let's put the dogs back in the dog area all the way to there. Let's put the pigs back in the pig area. Where does that start? Right here. All the way to here. You guys go collect things. And the centipedes won't be here in time. Heck, they really won't. They're not going to be here for quite some time. Hmm. And I had something else I needed to do tonight. Tell you what. I'm going to pause here we'll watch this one go in we'll do the centipedes as the next where are you going not one of my wild boars you're fleeing something okay <laughs> fair enough that was a, a typical mortar last time we used mortars we nailed several of them bullseyed that was not typical, believe me. This is typical for mortars and moving targets. But yeah, with that, let's call this a shorter episode. We took out the scythers. We lost our, our big ace up the sleeve, our orbital beam targeting system weapon thingy. And we've got left EMP grenades. We could jump into the EMP mortars as we get closer to rounding 
the bend here. One, two, three, four, five. I gotta remember there's another one right here. You are a charge blaster. I think you're kind of like what the scythers were shooting at us. Got to think about him separately. I need to get four or five in place to deal with him. I do. And then with the rest of them, I'm all ready to do this. Probably with EMPs and with um, EMP mortars. All targeting them, stalling them, pausing them while we pop out and shoot. It wouldn't hurt to maybe get a regular grenade or two in there as well. And then get one of these. At the time, probably both of these set up to run these four EMPs. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. All that requires a little more thinking. So I'm gonna, gonna call this done at this time, and we'll tackle phase two next time. It's been Noble Rambler. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye-bye.